hey guys welcome back welcome back to the channel in this video let's have a look on the windows 11 new update so i am using the windows 11 developer version so in this windows 11 developer version got a new windows 11 build the new windows 11 build 22 16 so i am going to share you some of the new updates of this build on this windows 11 operating system so firstly the new update from the windows side is that so windows has actually added some of the new policies in the group policy editor so these are the some of the new policies so they have actually added up to nine different policies so the one is disabling quick settings flyout disable notification center and calendar flyout and disable all taskbar settings and disable search across uh, start and uh, taskbar hide task view from the taskbar block customization of pinned in start hide recommended in start disable start context menus and hide all apps in start so totally like this uh, nine different uh, group policies has been added in the group policy editor on windows 11 so you can able to customize these options in your windows 11 pc for that you have to just go to the search bar and type for a group policy so and after that you will get a edit group policy option so just click on that and in this option so you have to just select the user configuration and after that go to the option administrative templates and here is the start menu and taskbar folder just to open that so here is all the list of uh, group policies in this policies windows is additionally added nine different uh, policy settings so you can able to customize that so i have actually tried some of that it actually didn't work now but in in future it will be work so and also you can also go and check out this also just go to the computer configuration and after that in the computer configuration go to the administrative templates and here is the start menu and taskbar so once a year it just try some of the things so just read all these policies and you can able to do that so in case for example i'm just showing something so in case if i want to hide the task view button means just to open that policy by default it will be in the not configured state so to hide the task view button so i'm just clicking on the enabled and click on the apply and click on the ok so now this setting option has been hidden so we can check out that just go to the settings option now and after that just go to the personalization and after that just go to the taskbar option and here is the task view option so we have recently hidden this option in the group policy editor so that that particular option will not shown in the windows 11 uh, settings option by default setting option itself it will be grayed out so this is the one of the thing and like that you can able to customize some more option in this group policy editor so this is the thing and in this group policy editor nine different policies has been added Added by windows this will be greatly helpful for the it admins and the next so, new update is so whenever you are using the windows 11 developer version means there will be a watermark at the bottom right side so now in this build windows has removed that watermark and they actually says that it will not the final so for this build only the watermark has been disabled and again the watermark will be shown so this is what they actually said so and the next update is that we are all using the phone link application now for that phone link application there will be a dedicated setting option has been included for this you have to just go to the settings option and there go to the bluetooth and devices and here is the option phone link so there is a dedicated setting option has been given in the windows 11 settings so by just clicking on this phone link option it will be directly microsoft store in case if you are already installed means and it will be directly restored to the phone link application if you are not installed means it goes to the microsoft store and from there you can easily install the phone link application and i don't know why they actually included this option in the windows 11 settings by default so i didn't know what will be there in future updates so what your guys thoughts on this let me know in the comment section below i think in future they might be include some of the android app support also maybe so in samsung phones you can able to use the android apps right from the windows 11 pc itself so in case if you are using a samsung phone means you can able to use that like that they also bring up the updates for other smartphones also maybe so what are your guys thoughts on this let me know in the comment section below well now finally the next thing is that so it is not an update so we are always using a system tray option in the most of the windows so in the taskbar as you've seen here so you'll get a system tray like a top arrow key like option will be there so there will be all the hidden application will be available now in this windows learn build 2216 that icon is actually disappeared 
I don't know whether Windows is actually removed this option or disappeared or I think they actually having issues in system tray icon option for this build only but in the future build there will be a possibility of again bringing back that system tray icon because it will be a really a daily usage for accessing some of the hidden apps and one more thing is that in case if you are now going to access that system tray apps means so how do you access so I am also wanted to access some of the system tray based apps so how do we access that so for that just go to the settings option and there go to the option personalization and then go to the option taskbar so here just go to the other system tray icons just click on that so here is all the list of application available in that system tray so in case you are already using that system tray means so all the list of application will be shown here in case if you want to access some of the hidden apps on the system tray means you can able to find out all the apps which are available in that system tray so just turn on that so once you turn on that means and all this uh, app icons will be shown in that directly in the taskbar itself so like this you can do that because in this uh, windows 11 built 22 16 so the currently the system tray icon has been disappeared so that is the thing well now overall so these are all the some of the updates and issues on the windows 11 build 22 16 now what are your guys thoughts on this windows 11 new updates let me know in the comment section below and that's it for today video guys and hopefully if you guys new to this channel means hit the subscribe button below and if you like this video hit the like button and share to your friends well now that's it for today video and thanks for watching this video guys